In this video, we're talking about why I quit my solar marketing agency. In this video, if you've been following me for a while, you know that that's how my solar journey started. It started back in late 2019. I didn't know anything about the sales side of it. All I knew was marketing. I got started my marketing journey and the reason for it is because it was the cheapest business model possible that I could get started in. That's the honest to God truth. I didn't start it because I knew what I was doing. It was more like figure shit out on the fly. That's what I decided to do. I got balls deep into it and we figured it out. We spent quite a bit of money and so we became one of the best at it. I figured that that's the problem that all solar people have, how to generate leads. Now, the reason why I I decided to change and switch my model and go from the marketing model and switch completely to sales is simply because of the vehicle. As my boy Alex Hormozzi likes to say, I'm gonna have to change the hat for this one. The boat you're in is more important than how hard you row. And what that quote actually stands for is that the boat, which represents a business vehicle, is more important than how hard the person in the boat is actually rowing. And I feel like this quote is the perfect representation of the two vehicles that I decided to pursue in the solar industry. One of them being marketing, the other one being the sales side of it. Now it has everything to do with the offer. So if you don't know anything about the solar marketing and how it works and how agencies usually proceed with that business model, usually what it is is they charge a monthly retainer plus like a percentage of ad spend every single month. And the problem with this business model is that it's not very unique. In a competitive market, which is solar, obviously, it's very difficult to scale. It is very difficult to have people stick around because most people don't have the right money mindset when it comes to achieving success in the solar industry, they think they can invest a few thousand dollars and get rich off of it. And obviously it doesn't work like that. And what would happen in a lot of cases with our clients was that they would sell some deals, they would put some money towards ad spend, they'll run out of money, and then they'll have to wait for the back ends to hit in order to get paid so that they can continue paying us. All in all, there was a lot of variables that could have been messed up, which is exactly, of course, what took place. A lot of people wouldn't know how to navigate through following up, pitching these leads over the phone or setting their appointments. And so with solar on the other side, which is now selling directly to homeowners, the offer itself, there is very minimal competition. I know that we have a superior product than most companies out there. It's a no brainer to the homeowner. And in any business that you're in, you want to make money, you're going to have to improve somebody's life. The reality is, is that if you market Market the same offer across the same audience that everybody else is hitting, your chances of success are gonna be very, very slim. And that's what was happening with the marketing agency. And at some point, I just decided that it was time to move on. And now we've decided to pursue solar sales full time, the dealer model, selling over the phone, and helping homeowners save on their electricity. And I'm super excited once again to get on this journey and start building a team and show you all what's possible in solar. So to leave you with this, my decision to change paths was predominantly based upon the vehicle. The vehicle right now, which is solar, is absolutely enormous and the lease market is super amazing. We already have an irresistible offer to offer homeowners and I know we absolutely are going to crush it. And that's the main differentiation point between selling marketing to solar pros and selling people on the idea of solar and lowering their utility bill. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a massive thumbs up. And if you have any questions for me, leave them down in the comments below. So I'll see you all in the next video.